Yeah, okay. this is before the third day of treatment. Before the third day of treatment, so this is only two days in. Um, Cheryl slept all night last night, um, not up one single time, no snoring. It was restful, sleeping, normal, like anyone else. I had to wake her up this morning at 6.15. Um, we went to dinner last night, which doesn't seem like a big deal, but for the past year, an entire year, we have not been able to eat in a restaurant because um, we would pull up to, to eat and she would either be so nauseated or so in so much pain that she couldn't get out of the car. And um, we've actually gone in and had to leave. We've actually gone in and because I would try to tell her to fight past it and mm -hmm. we would get in there and we would have to leave. So we have not eaten in a restaurant. Everything has been just get it in a bag and take it back where she can lay down. And um, it's been like force feeding because she um, lost so much weight because of the pain. Um, that eating to her isn't even a pleasant experience. So last night we went to IHOP and had dinner and um, she was able to be pleasant and, and happy a, watched and a movie. watched a movie, had a restful evening and then she fell asleep. So this morning she woke up and normally mornings are really, really bad because she's uh, she knows that when she wakes up, she's going to start right away in pain. Usually when she puts her foot on the, her left foot on the floor to get up to go to the bathroom, that's usually when the pain just, just jumps right then, and then it's never ending for the rest of the day. Um, she got up this morning, I woke her up gently with um, coffee, and um, just said it's time to get up, and the lights were still out and she woke up wanting to be af afraid and she woke up and was calm and fine and and the pain never took yeah. over green oh well, <laughs> tell me what you think so far i i just can't believe it i mean i called my mom last night and she said you know how are you going how's it going and stuff and i just said it's great and i just started laughing and talking and i was just smiling and just um like so happy and stuff and she couldn't believe i was the same person you know and she's like you know you're kidding and i said no and it was just so awesome but to be able to sit there and order have dinner Go to go inside, you know, like that, and not uh, force feeding. I just eat just to, so I can take a pill. Um, but um, and to, like right now, I have no nausea. I have no face pain. My pain level is so low that I, I can't. You know, I'm afraid to say because I was you know, was afraid to say something like jinx it. But, um, it's, Did it hit a five yet? That was what we were hoping for. Um, we're close, very close to a five. But for me sitting here this morning, we were early. My sister and I walked at this place. Super. Three or four times. I couldn't do that on I mean, a billion dollar bet, you know. Uh, for me just to walk to the car, that's that's good. We walked to the bathroom. Very yeah. good. Are well, you ready to get started with day three? Very. Just waiting on you. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay. Oh. Let me see your left foot. Okay. No, when we first started with you, this was painful. Then it became partially pain and partially cold, correct? Okay, yeah. So what does it feel like right now? Is it cold or is it painful or both? It's uh, both, but I feel the ice more. Okay. Cold. Okay, good. Okay, huh? 
How's your left foot feel? Good. I mean, it feels pretty. I mean, like, rip, it feels good. It feels mellow. It feels, um, um, I've got pain, but it's nothing, nothing at all above, you know. Um, I can't tolerate it, and there's very little pain. And it's like, wow. Is that below a five? It, it's pretty, it's pretty close to a five. Which I've never said that about my left foot, ever, ever, um, in, in over a year. But it's, <laughs> it feels so good.